What about you? What are you doing later? Fancy a trip into town? I know the vets aren't exactly busy right now. Oh, that's something of an understatement. But I'm taking a drive out later. I've booked a surprise lunch at some fancy little gastro pub for me and charity. Well, might as well make the most of my free time. I'm sorry. No, don't be daft. Still got a full day off ahead of me. World's my oyster, isn't it? What? Everything all right? Um, uh, yeah. Sure. Fine. Oh, here she is. Yay! How was the dentist? I haven't been to the dentist. No, no, no. I think you'll find that's why you're late, remember? No, I'm late, cos... I don't know. I'm just late. But you're very sorry and it won't happen again, right? I don't know. Oh, really? In fact, I don't care. Well, I do. Well, fine. Can I just get on with my work, please? Wonderful. Well, now that's sorted and she's here, you can man the bar. What can I get you? We just wanted to catch Vic. But perhaps now's not the best time. Is she OK? Look, this date she had yesterday with this Leon, or whatever his name is. Oh, please don't tell me he stopped the night. No, he didn't. He started mouthing off, giving Vic a hard time, so out he went. Apparently, Vic gave as good as she got. Even so. It's really hit her for six. And the fact remains, she hasn't been herself since she found out Adam's met someone else. Well, if you want to talk to her, go ahead, please. Maybe she'll listen to you two. Well, she didn't yesterday to either of us. But stranger things have happened. Maybe we'll uh, let her settle in first. Maybe shouldn't you be at the hospital? I've already been. I'm going back later, so... You know, you could get a place of your own sorted by the time Sarah comes out. Yeah, it's not that. Well, babe, what is it? So, who fancies a drive out for lunch at an amazing gastro pub? They keep their own goats. It's so cute. Oh, sorry, have I... No, 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 it's fine. Give me five minutes and I'll be ready to go. <laughs> it's a joke. I'm joking. <laughs> you two go, have a great time. Go on. Let's go, I'll be fine. Yeah? OK. I'll see you later. I thought you and Charity were off to some fancy gastro pub. Oh, waste of journey. When we got there, they had to shut leaking pipe or something. Didn't even get to see the goats. We're off to the swanky art gallery tomorrow, if you fancy it. Sorry, did you just say art gallery? Yeah, it's where they hang paintings and people go and look at them. Funny. Mm, you know your dad's the real art expert. Oh, I, I don't know. I see you're doing your homework. Well, I just want to see what all the fuss is about. Well, you'll be seeing the paintings for real tomorrow. Yeah, you know, I'm really looking forward to it. Actually, I'd go so far as to say I think I'm going to come away from this exhibition with a whole new appreciation for the art world. I don't want to fall out with Vic. She's clearly not having an easy time of it. No, no, but to be... to be fair, she does seem a lot calmer now. Glad to hear it. Oh! Steady! Oh, you can barely even see it. Get a grip. No, I was just... I'm sorry, Vic. There's no need to bite my head off. Look, I know you're having a bit of a tough time at the moment or whatever. Oh, yeah? And what do you know? Well, I know I'm probably never going to get this stain out. That's one thing. Oh. Well, why don't you try this on for size? No! no, no. <gasps> Did you see what she just done? I am so sorry. That was... that was totally uncalled for. Why am I even bothering? Vanessa, I'm really sorry. Well, it's not your fault, is it? But if I were you, I'd get Victoria in check before Charity gets back in ears about this. Well, there's not much you can do. I mean, you saw her. She walks so upset. Yeah, well, maybe it's for the best. Well, not the upset bit, obviously, but you know what I mean. You OK? Yes, Dad, I'm great. Right, I'm going to go home and get changed. I'll see you later. <laughs> 